the next thing I want to do is I'm going to show you how to submit a file in Canvas. So what I'm going to do is this file is in this list of files. It's right here. And I can, now there's a few things I can do. I could move this window over and I could drag that file onto my desktop. If I do that, it will move this file. It'll take it out of here and put it here. And that's fine if I'm completely done using it and I'm on a school computer and I'm gonna bail after this and the, the file's just gonna get deleted anyway. But if I'm on my computer and I wanna keep that code for later so I can copy and paste from myself, which you will wanna do for sure, um, then I don't wanna do that. What I'd, what I'd rather do is copy and paste it like that. And then there's the file right there. So I've copied and pasted it onto my desktop. Then I, then I have it in both places. And that's useful. Because now that I'm in Canvas, right, I'm going to view it as a student because my view is a little different. Okay, so this is what your canvas looks like. If I want to go to A1, assignment one, I'm gonna choose start assignment, and I'm gonna scroll down here to the bottom, and I'm gonna say choose file. On my desktop, I'm looking for A1. <clears throat> there it is, A1.py, hit open and I hit submit assignment. Now, if I do it right, I should get some confetti here in a second. There we go. And it says submitted, it says the time, and I can download that if I need, if I get paranoid that I submitted the right thing, I can check it. But if I named it properly, then it's less likely to be something else. Um, and that's it. And so you can resubmit as many times as you need to. But once I get those, I will go through and give you feedback. And if, if you do it correctly, like if, if, your, if your file is perfect, I might say, hey, you did a really good job on this. But most of the time, I'm just going to give you the points and move on. Just consider that like my applause for you. Um, most of the time, if I give you feedback on, a, on an assignment, it's going to be because I want you to fix something or, or resubmit it. Sometimes if it's just something minor, and I think, man, you've got a really bad habit of doing this and it's not going to serve you well long term, maybe I'll just say, hey, heads up, in the future, let's do this differently. Um, if you submit a screenshot of your code, I'm going to kick it back because I, I, need, I need to see your actual code. A screenshot of code is not what I want. I want the actual Python file to be submitted. And some people take a screenshot and then name it a1.py. That still doesn't, it still doesn't work. Not the same thing. In fact, when I open that in Python, it just... It looks like a bunch of garbage. So, because uh, it's actually the image data that I'm looking at at that point. So, that is how you submit your assignment. And I think we're nearing the end of the lecture. So, you'll have a little bit of time here to actually do the work. Any other questions before before I cut you loose to work on A1? No? Okay.